hey y'all, we don't do enough Ford Ranger customizations and we're trying to change that with a beautiful Cactus Gray 2021 Akins Ford Ranger XLT FX2 edition. That's right, this is a two wheel drive covert edition with a new color. Uh, my man, Mac Bryce is considering this color for his Bronco. So what I'm saying is this color is a popular color that we like to see uh, on this vehicle and future vehicles to come. It's a really nice color. Uh, let's show them Bray. It looks like a fighter jet gray color almost. Show them that uh, Mach 1 Mustang, the fighter jet gray Mustang. So that is fighter jet gray. And then uh, the cactus gray to me looks a lot like that, but it has a green depth to it, especially in the shade. It has more of a green, a subtle green appearance to it. So uh, it's a very cool color to me. I think it's gonna look great on the Bronco and it certainly looks great uh, on our covert edition Ranger right here at Aikens. So we're leveled on 32s y'all, uh, 31.9 to be exact. We've got a two inch Fox coilover suspension leveling kit. A very nice, I, this rides better than the factory kit, honestly y'all. I love the way this rides. Uh, very, very supple. We've got KMC, KM722 wheels. It looks like an off roadist wheel, a KMC grenade, and a Mustang wheel all in one, the same package. It's a new wheel. I really do like it, y'all. 20 by 9. Uh, we're very plus on the offset so, to eliminate any kind of issues of rubbing or scrubbing. And uh, Toyo Open Country AT3, all terrain tire, 275, 55, 22. A very nice option when it comes to a tire tire package. And uh, let me know what you think about the wheel, wheel and tire combo. We think for a two wheel drive, uh, sporty off road looking truck. It's very fitting, so I like the way this looks. Now, uh, up front, we had to do a custom painted emblem with this. So we did cactus gray on the chrome and blue to black, and that just looks so phenomenal to us. Uh, if you just left that emblem factory, of course, it's a tried and true Ford color, but it just would not look nowhere near as good in our opinion. So let me know what you think about that beauty right there. I uh, got the nice little silver skid plate going on with some nice magnetic accents going throughout. And then coming on around, we could have done, let's show them a good side shot, Bray, the full scope of the vehicle. We did not do any uh, running boards because a two wheel drive truck, you could say it needs running boards or it doesn't. So we opted just to leave it off since, since it is a two wheel drive truck. Uh, in, entry and exit is not bad at all without them. I can understand if uh, you know you may have some issue or may want to add step bars, but we just left them off uh, currently. Now coming on back to the back, we got rear wheel well liners. We got an Aiken spray in liner, guaranteed for life. And the Ranger is just a, a great niche vehicle for uh, that that certain consumer. Very nifty. We got the custom badge out back too. The cactus gray just looks great, especially out back with that custom emblem like that. Yep, now mild to wild scale, we're pretty conservative, uh, but we're definitely sticking out a little bit more past factory. We're probably an inch and a half, what do you say, Bray? Two, two inches outside the fender well, but I think it's a, it's a nice stance, kind of like the Jeeps that we do. I feel like the, the handling, ride quality, and safety is improved with this setup because it gives you a little bit wider stance and a little bit more supple ride, a little more confidence while steering on your handling side also. So I really like that. Now we have a Roush. Uh, exhaust out back was a cold air intake. So while Brady's back here, I'm gonna crank this bad boy up. Now, first of all, first off, you may be thinking the engine with a exhaust, eh, but it's gonna impress you. Watch this. Now, obviously it's not a V8, so it's not gonna have that V8 sound, but for what it is, y'all, I think it sounds really good. You drive it down the road, there's no drone whatsoever, uh, and it had just a little bit more of a deep, deep throaty tone to it that just makes you, makes you, makes everybody know that you mean business, and it's got a, a really nice sound. It's not overbearing, it's not a obnoxious, ricey sound, so even under load, I think it has a very nice tone to it. Now, in addition to that, we added a, we wanted the flow uh, coming in and going out to be increased. So we did a, a Roush cold air intake under the hood. It's a good look at that cold air intake. So your stock factory 
intake has uh, diversion tubes. It has tubes jutting off here left and right, and this is not as big, so it just restricts your airflow, which restricts your power and performance. So Roush does a good job of giving you some more added benefits uh, and some more power options and just a, a better overall performance. All right, uh, showing you the window sticker, guys. 21 Ranger here at Aikens. MSRP base, base price, $34,775. Uh, pause this in the video if you want to see the options. So it's not a four-wheel drive, it's a two-wheel drive. It's an FX2 package, which gives you off-road tuned uh, suspension, um, electronic locking diff. So you got electronic locking rear diff in case you need to get out of any kind of jam, a trailer tow package. Uh, just a great overall benefit. Now what we did with our covert package was add the, the 2.0 coilover leveling kit. So if we took the um, performance suspension and put a spacer on it, it would negate that. So we had to do a tried and true legit uh, leveling kit system. The cold air intake and exhaust, there's your weather tire combo, weather text, painted emblems, paint protection film, and, and liner. Now paint protection film is found multiple locations inside your, your um, jams right here and then also on the edge guard so protects from getting any any chips from uh, banging doors or whatnot looks great now a good interior shot shows you the weathertech floor mats uh, sport seating and um, a nice setup with a center console shifter eight inch screen and more love that so covert edition ranger We're going to have a Overland style theme coming soon too, so be sure and stay tuned for that. Brady, let's give him one more angled shot right here of this beautiful covert. Let us know what you think about uh, this cactus gray color. I think it's a hit. I don't think this vehicle is going to last very long. Um, and we've got more Rangers coming to you right here at Aikens and Wild Willys. We're going to dive into doing four drive builds and some ones that's got some more capability off-road as well as more power. We love more power here at Aikens, so stay tuned for that. I'm Neil Shepard, Brady Rambo behind the camera, Aikens, Wild Willys, peace.